Do you know where we are? Sure, we're at the waterfall by the Mendenhall Glacier. Yeah, well, but where's the glacier? Do you know? It's over there. Oh, do you know that it has been receding? Yes. <laughs> What's with all the Juno droves? Our first stop here in Juneau is Nugget Falls, and here we can get an earth cache. That's right, an earth cache. I'm so excited, aren't you? Don't you love earth caches? Come on, let's go take a look. Juneau, officially the city and borough of Juneau, is the capital of the U.S. state of Alaska, located in the Alaskan Panhandle. As of the 2020 census, the city and borough had a population of 32,255 people. Juneau experiences a daily influx of 21,000 people or more from visiting cruise ships between the months of May and September. One of them is about posting a picture, which, according to the rules, you don't really have to do. Or, you do, but it doesn't have to have your face in it. It's more fun to do. Yeah, so here's our picture. Cheese! If only everybody else knew that there was an earth cache here, and how cool geocaching is. But at least you do. And let us know in your comments what you like about geocaching so much. Is it earth caching? I bet you it isn't. The waterfall behind me, and just over here, you can make out just a little bit of the Mendenhall Glacier. Recently, it was observable that the glacier was down into the lake, and you could get a photograph of both the waterfall and the glacier at the same time. But the glacier has now receded beyond the point there where you can just see the top of it. But we'll get a picture of that from further back up the trail where we came up to. You can see the glacier really well. And the group's got all the information they need. There's all the questions answered. And we have our photos for the waterfall. So we're gonna head back up the trail to the visitor center where we can get another four earth caches and one virtual. So at least maybe we can get six geocaches on this one stop here in Juneau, Alaska. Thank goodness for Wet Coaster and Green Wars from our party. They realized there was an adventure lab here, which I forgot to check for. So now we're getting the answers to that on our way back. On the way back to the visitor center, we took the path less traveled and had the place pretty much all to ourselves. So nice and peaceful and quiet. And another stop on this earth cache is a sign that says a waterfall that moved. You get some information from that. And then you can either take a photo of yourself back at the striations or up ahead with the Mendenhall Glacier looking huge behind you. So the glacier right now is way back here, but according to the sign uh, depiction, where we're standing right here in these rocks, there was a waterfall right here, and the glacier was right at this spot. So since then has melted all that way in over 50 years. And a third earth cache just below the visitor center talks about the flower water. Flower, yes. The Glacial till is churned up and ground down into what's called flour. At the rate that this uh, at the rate that this glacier is moving, they're going to have to move the visitor center pretty soon because it's going to be out of sight. Go, 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 go! <laughs> We're running to try to get the last location for the adventure lab because we only got eight minutes seven minutes before we have to get back on the bus when we're trying to get there and we have 27 meters to go oh answer popped up and it's a multiple choice oh yes 
Uh, well, how about number three? That's no. Number one, no. Number two, no. Number three? Number yes, number three! And we got it! We've completed the adventure lab and we can get back on the bus. Yay! Yay! <laughs> well, that was fantastic. We got the adventure lab completed. Now, we're gonna go back and we're gonna explore Juno right downtown. Saloon! <laughs> I always wanted to go through saloon doors. Watch, there we go. Oh, we're in the saloon. Woo, this is cool. Where we go? Where'd they go? That way. Ah. Well, this is cool, and there's even sawdust on the floor. Holy cow. No wonder it felt so weird. What is this thing called? A duck fart. A duck fart. Is Bailey's, Kahlua, and Crown Royal. Oh. And you All got right. to do this shot. We have okay. To get, what okay. did she say? There was something that you have to do. Yeah, yeah. You have to go one quack, shot. Quack. Whoa, quack, quack. 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 Okay, That's here's saying, a duck fart to you and Juno, Alaska, to Cash Canada. <laughs> uh, quack, quack. That is good. We found a five, one and a half. Yeah, it was really cool. It was right near the event that we held, and uh, we met some local geocaches. Did I tell them that we had a bit of help from the raspberry? Oh, well, yeah, everybody needs some help, especially us. <laughs> and we just had that uh, duck fart drink. That was pretty cool. That's and then we're going to finish with an adventure lap. Yeah, uh, after we have some nachos with our friends uh, that we're geocaching with on this incredible cruise. Say hi, everybody. Hi. There we go. Hey. All right. Keep watching. There's more caches to be found. Where will geocaching take you? Where will geocaching take you? Where will geocaching take you? A really cool thing here is there's a gun at the bar. Because in uh, old time uh, Juno, they had to check their guns at the bar. And they weren't around to take them on. So why on earth? Wyatt Earp was here, he checked his gun in, but the thing is, he never came back to pick it up, so they posted it right there in the bar. Believe it or not.